morning and welcome everyone to Live from the Fast Lane, powered by The Garage. It's day two of the Repco Bathurst 1000. And joining me this morning, it's motorsports version of Eddie Everywhere, Greg Rust. It's so great to have you here. Welcome, Rusty. Uh, Brian, I'm on my apprenticeship. Thank you very much for having me. Be kind today. I'm trying to learn a lot. Um, this well, is going to be a lot of fun. Each day yeah. has been jam-packed. We've been here since whatever it was, Sunday, Monday for some people, and it ramps up another level today. The big game, the premier class, is on track and we cannot wait. Absolutely. Yeah, a bit going on behind us. Well, there was a bit. Uh, they've just stopped. But we're going to take a walk down the lane. Good so, timing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> great timing by us. Some pit stop practice, some team meetings going on this morning because, of course, today the supercars hit the track for the first time. 10 a.m. is the first of, uh, I think, six one-hour practice sessions across the weekend before we get to the big race. And you're going to be in the lane covering it all for I us I can't too. wait. Yeah, so, I mean, need a little bit of perspective here. It's a, it's a late call-up. We've got people like uh, Garth Tander, Craig Lowndes, Jack Perkins, who are busy behind the wheel. And some of our good mates, like mm. Marcus Ambrose, who's in Tassie. G'day, Marcus, if you're, um, if you're watching. And Greg Murphy, who couldn't get over either. So, yeah. um, so just a little bit of help, Bryony. It's nice to be back with some friends uh, doing, doing what I love and hopefully answering some questions for you guys. Absolutely. So we're just walking past the combo here of Nick Perkett and Dale Wood. Dale Wood, one of several drivers doing double duty this weekend. You're calling plenty of the support category action and of course there's plenty of drivers in the main game which we're also seeing across some of the support categories too. Can we just say a massive thank you to the men and women behind the scenes that have made this whole deal come together for an awesome festival of motorsport. The lineup of support categories is absolutely top drawer and you talk about double duty mm. in just about every class you can find someone doubling up doing something else. Not all of them are, are doubling up to run in the in the Bathurst 1000, but some some people are doing TCR and then jumping in an S5000 car. Yes. There's Trans Am, Porsche Carrera Cup, a whole lot more. You, you are going to love it. We're just going to take a, a look around here because there is some pit stop practice happening. The 96 car of Macaulay Jones and Chris Pither going How through the paces. Look? No driver changes happening. There have been quite a few driver changes happening this morning up and down the lane. Not here. This one is just for the crew. Because obviously pit stops here at Bathurst, Rusty, they're pretty crucial, aren't they, in most, terms most of uh, I mean, having a good result? So much happens um, in the lane. I've just walked out this morning and spoken with uh, with Mark Larkham, who is here, trackside with us as well. So from whether, you know, whether it's the technical side, the human side, uh, whatever, and even in the paddock too. Lots of great stories in the paddock that we'll cover for you as the, as the weekend unfolds. Yeah, exactly. Let's walk down and take a look at... We had a look at these yesterday, but I'm not sure if we've shown them on uh, live from the fast lane yet. The new livery for Andre Heimgartner and Matt Campbell, number seven, Kelly Grove Racing. I'm going to have to duck in to the shade to really see the look... But this matte black, Rusty, like up close, I don't know if you've had a, a chance to get a good yep. look at it. This is one of the, uh, for mine, one of the better liveries for this weekend. For well, sure. well, can we counterbalance it? We'll go, we'll go yes. around this way as well because here is Luke Yulden and David Reynolds' car. Check that out. Now with a bit of blue and red through it, it looks awesome, doesn't it? And there was actually a competition. So the fans got to choose the livery for car 26. Here uh, he this is. This is the one they chose. Speaking of... Hello, Andre Heimgartner. <laughs> Live. Come on in, come on in, come and join us. How are you? Oh, delightful. We're yeah, excited to do some racing today. So I think everyone is, aren't they? <laughs> yeah. Because all um, yeah, well, the COVID stuff, a lot of people have been up here since Sunday and Saturday, Saturday even. So, yeah, it's been a long week, but, yeah, everything's ready and we're ready. So. Big year for, for Matty Campbell abroad. Pretty cool that he can come back and, and be a part of this. And he's really looking excited to putting a, a good foot forward back in this Supercars paddock, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, I think it's going to be really exciting. Exciting for him and very exciting for me. The last time I had a, you know, a top-grade driver was when I had Bryce and we um, you know if it wasn't for some fuel stuff would have definitely been on the podium so really looking forward to that um, it makes my job a bit easier you hand the car over and you're like it's all fine you know it'll be up as fast as anyone um, hopefully faster and um, yeah you don't have to worry about him obviously crashing the car doing stuff like that because you know he's won the Bathurst 12 hour here did an yeah. amazing job there so almost the best guy you could get. What's the plan for the first practice this morning? So the first one, an hour long, it's for all drivers. Yeah. So it could be yourself or Maddie. Have you got a plan yet of who who do what? Um, I'll do most of that driving. Um, yeah, it's, it's changed a little bit now, but um, basically me just getting the handle of it, seeing what the car's doing to start with. Um, but you've got to make sure you don't get too carried away with chasing the car because over the weekend the yeah. track will evolve so much. So it's more just me getting comfortable than I'll do a practice start at the end. So just getting used to that, depending on who starts. And um, yeah, very different here at the start 
use a lot of throttle percentage, obviously big first gear, so yeah, a lot, lots of fine tuning, I guess. Massive week for everybody here at the mountain, and loads of interest for, for those that are watching on social media this morning here in Australia, but especially so back home in New Zealand, the thirst, the appetite for the great race there is massive, mate, isn't it? Yeah, it's good. I, I guess they're halfway through the day now in New Zealand, but... Um, <laughs> Yeah, it's good, good in New Zealand. I uh, hear the, the new owners of supercars really um, are valuing the New Zealand support and that um, you know in the future there'll be more racing there and more about the New Zealand um, fan base, which is really exciting. I was one of those kids back in the day watching Murph, Engel, all those guys at Pukekohe on the hill there. So hopefully um, you know we can give more young kids that experience. Yeah, fantastic. I was just thinking with the time difference. So with the latest start to the great race this year, it'll be about 2.15. Yeah in New Zealand, so you're going to gonna have, gonna yeah. have to... I'll be lucky to be coherent <laughs> by that. I was going to say, you're going to have to temper the Ned Whiskies <laughs> with your friends and family back home. <laughs> exactly. It's like a late afternoon party, really, isn't it? What's back well, lots of people that I know over there are, are gearing up there. They're making it a party that will go right into the into the night. It's going to be good. Yeah. yeah, I think everyone is looking really looking forward to it. even here at the event. It has a vibe about it that, you know, everyone's just been let out of school on school holidays almost. So I think it's going to be really cool. Everyone that I've spoken to is obviously watching it, and I think, you know, this being this part of the year, it's interesting because we don't have the football, we don't have other things we're competing with, I guess, so um, we have more of the market, I guess, and we're the you know, main sporting event at this time, so definitely a lot of interest going around. I know there's a change of scene for you next year, mate, but a real strong will to, to complete this chapter with Maddie and the crew on this car in, in, uh, in great fashion. Go get them and have a fantastic weekend. Yeah, cheers. Good to finish it off with a strong result. Yeah, Good Thanks, Andre. Yeah, Cannot nice wait. Cheers. Uh, for, as we said, first practice for supercars at 10am this morning. But, Rusty, there is so, so much more on the Fox Sports broadcast today. Starting at 8.25am on Fox Sports 503. What else have we got on What have we got on today, apart from two supercars practice well, sessions? Well, in addition to the Touring Car Masters, which are coming up a, a, a little later today, uh, Trans Am is on track as well. I love the way Fox have... Uh, made, uh, uh, again, a, a massive week of things and more. There's all these, oh, come here, come here. David Reynolds, don't <laughs> run away. How are you? Oh, it's Russell, lovely to see good you to see too. As the bromance continues. <laughs> How you going? All right, how about you? Good, man. Good to see you. Good to see you too. So we're about to hit the track today. Uh, how excited are you about that? I mean, a big, big end to the year, mate. Yeah, yeah can't wait. Um, been here for a couple of days and you just watch all the other categories go around. You're like, oh, I just want to go have a go. So... Yeah, practice ones are like 10 o'clock, so I'm just quietly psyching myself up for that. What do you do in the... I mean, naturally, Never lots of... Never ask me that. No, no, no. I bet, I mean, there's he hasn't lots finished of... the sentence, oh, okay, David. Sorry. Just okay. wait. So I'll try again. I'm, I'm an apprentice journalist here. No, no. Help, help me out. Be kind to me, David. Um, uh, in, what, I mean, in addition to the, the commitments for the team and, and, and fans and press and whatever else, what, what have you been doing in the, in the couple of days here <laughs> leading up? And how do you... Because you, you're watching stuff on track, you love it, but do you try and switch off a little bit too so you ease into the weekend? What do you do? Yeah, yeah I just um, take the piss out of everyone and <laughs> crack jokes. Me included? Yeah, everyone, <laughs> yeah. No, yeah, no, everyone that stands in my way, they, they get mocked. Yeah. So, mate, I'm just here having fun, enjoying my life and yeah, looking forward to racing. But, uh, you know, obviously we have meetings and we talk about what, what the strategy was, winning ones before, what have we done in the past, yeah. you know, how, how our car's been affected by this, that and the other and... You know, we were talking about rain a lot over the last couple of days, but hasn't rained at all yet, so today. it's yeah. beautiful. But they say it might rain possibly later, but I know the forecast has been pretty wrong of late, so um, yeah, we're just, just seeing what, what happens. I've just got to ask, because there was a fan vote to decide the livery for your car for Bathurst, Bathurst 1000. Are you happy with the one that was chosen? Very, very, very happy, very, yeah. very happy. Well, it's an Australian flag. It's a yeah. true blue Aussie flag. Um, the first rendition we ever had was a little bit, the, the colour was quite wrong, um, but they luckily we rectified it and it's looking good. It's really good. Yeah, nice one. Have a fantastic day yeah. today, mate. Go, go well for the entire weekend. Thanks, Greg. Good to see you. Got the combo, the combo from 2017. Many of them are all together yeah. again, mate. Good vibe. Yeah, there's only, only another combination that have won before. Is that right? Yeah, I think there's one, one yeah, or two, a, not I think many. it's Wing Cup you're, and Lounge and then it's us. So. All right, do you yeah. want to take over? This, do you want to just do the TV stuff? Yeah, you, give, give you, you, you've I'll got all the stats. Goodbye. <laughs> Good to see you. Are you still rapping? Are you going to be a rapper? Uh, no, I'd, no. Not, I'd love to try one day. <laughs> Good to Jeez, see you. Jeez, it's a worry when David Reynolds knows more stats than us, isn't it? <laughs> yes, it is. It is. Um, OK, you can catch all the action. Fox Sports at 5.03. It all kicks off at 8.25 a.m. We are on air all day covering every single session. I've just got a, an alarm on my phone. I think it's time for me to go and make 
make your coffee. Thank you. Um, it's part of my contract <laughs> for the weekend. Thanks for the comments too, guys. Keep them coming. Leave them down below. Have a fantastic week of, uh, of motorsport. We'll update you as often as we can right Absolutely. here. Absolutely. Bye for now.